I've just arrived in Petersfield, checked into my hotel, and I really fancy a curry tonight. So I'm gonna head into this lovely little town and see if I can find myself a nice little Indian restaurant. I'm not gonna to say too much about Petersfield in this video because my next video is going to be more in depth about Petersfield and the surrounding area. But on first impressions, I'll tell you what, I like this little village. There's no drug infused lager louts running down the road screaming their heads off. Someone coming up to you every two minutes saying, got any spare change? I've left my car unlocked in the car park behind the shops, but I'm not gonna go back to it because I know that when I do go back later on, all the contents and the car itself will still be there. Call me an old fart if you want, but do you know what? I'm getting to the stage in my life where I like that. Anyway, moving on gracefully, I've come out for a curry tonight and I've decided to go and visit this little Indian restaurant called The Spice Lounge. I've never heard anything about it, never been here before. This is the first time for me. Let's go and check this little place out and see what they've got to offer. Isn't it great when things fall into place? This must be my lucky day. I mean, I've just found this little Indian restaurant. It's lovely inside, the service is excellent, and they give you a choice. You can either have something from the main menu, or you can help yourself to the 16 pound a head, eat as much as you like buffet. I have got something to say about buffets that I'll talk about later on in this video. I have had a few bad experiences in the past, but yeah, as I say, I'll get onto that later on in this video. On that note, call me a pig if you like, but as you've probably guessed, I've decided I'm going to treat myself to the all-you-can-eat buffet. Chicken tikka masala, <coughs> lamb buna, lamb biryani, everything going on here, and a bit of chapati as well. It's a bit of a mix and match, but 
บางพอI do have a tendency, tendency to be a little bit wary of them because the food is being kept at a temperature between 60 and 65 degrees, which means it is actually still cooking. And if you get there late and it's been sitting around for a couple of hours, it can tend to be a little bit dry and a little bit overcooked. The best thing is to do is to go to a busy restaurant with a buffet or get there early. On this occasion, it was absolutely delicious. I mean, I did get there early, but they certainly know what they're doing. And uh, on that note, thanks very much for watching. And I'm going to check to see if my car's still there. Mm -hmm.